So let's talk about MIDI now. 2013 is the 30th anniversary of MIDI, and it's been incredibly um, useful for musicians over the, over the years and is still actually being used and developed. So what I have here, I have two keyboards. This one is my main controller, and then I've got this one set up, and I've got a cable, you can't see it, from running out from here into this one. So I'm going to turn this one's volume down. So when I play here, commands are going from this keyboard, play C, play D, play E, going up to this one, and the sound engine here is making sure that it makes the sounds. And you notice too, if I go here, it doesn't make that sound anymore. That's because I've got this one set for the external. It only sends those note commands from here on up to here. And notice when I play it direct, it's a different set of sounds. So what I can do is mix, let's turn this one back up, the two keyboards together. So the upper keyboard is just that part of the sound. I got a bass. So if I call up a different patch, let's turn the volume down here, the top keyboard different sounds. So I've got one sound on the top and then another sound on the bottom. Those are coming from up there. Turn that volume down. Turn this one up. So the bottom keyboard you've got guitar sound and then up top. So you combine the two and you get and then I could turn on the other parts and I just overloaded the, <laughs> the sound. So what you're hearing here are four sounds coming from this one, plus three sounds coming from that one. And then if I wanted to, I could take that third keyboard, run a cable, and, and, and connect them all. So I'm playing one note here, I could be having sounds here and here and there. And on that module that's up here, and, and, and. But that's all done in hardware. But essentially MIDI is a series of digital messages saying, hey, play middle C. Hey change sounds. Hey, play E. Play it kind of hard. That kind of stuff. So, and there are tons and tons of other messages, but that one thing means that when you add a computer into the mix, things get really interesting. That's the next section.